Soccer fans, welcome to Rio Tinto Stadium and the matchup of perhaps the two best teams in Major League Soccer tonight. It's RSL and Sporting Kansas shorthanded all year. Well, it is, and it's familiar faces. Jeff Atzanella gets the starting goal, his first in Major League Soccer. Aaron Mon comes in at center back alongside Nap Borchers. Luis Gill on the left-hand side of the midfield, Ned Grappavoy on the right. Javi Morales sitting underneath Jao Plata and Robbie Finley. Here's the Zango starting lineup for Sporting alongside guys like Kai Kamara and Graham Zussi. It makes them deadly. Well, the big news, Matt Beasler gets called up to the U.S. national team. So Ico Parra plays alongside Aurelio Collin, who's on yellow card warning. So far here this season for Sporting Kansas City. Match conditions tonight, in a word, they're hot. 93 degrees at kickoff here tonight with just a slight breeze out of the northwest. So glad you could be with us here this evening. It's RSL and Sporting Kansas City in the matchup of the season so far in Major League Soccer. And the first challenge early, Chris Wingert and Kai Kamara, and Wingert is down and holding his right shoulder. Kamara down as well, Wingert rolling over, and that was a tough challenge in the early moments of this match, Brian. Well, we take another look at it. Chris Winger comes extremely tight with Kai Kamara, and he jumps early, goes right into Kai Kamara, levels him, just absolutely levels Kai Kamara. It'll be very interesting to see how the referee, Matthew Forrester, deals with this. Aurelian and Colin already sitting on yellow card warning straight into the mix. And what does that say? You know, I think it says again. Brandon McDonald, just like Kari Stevenson, just like Lovell Palmer, just like Josh Saunders, just like Jao Plata. RSL has figured out a way to bring in another established veteran. Matthew Forrester handing out the yellow card confirmation. Chris Winger going to the book in the third minute. He was sitting on yellow card warning, so that means he will miss the next match. Nielsen's out. Gill across. Loose in the six. And Collin will let Nielsen handle it. Kansas City dodges a bullet. The Sporting Kansas City having a difficult time with the pace up top between Jean Plata and Robbie Finley. Great job from Luis Gill getting on the end. Watch the buildup. It floats in, gets away. Jimmy Nielsen's committed, coming off his line. He thinks he's going to get there first. And unfortunately for Luis Gill, he just couldn't hook that back just a little bit more. No secondary run in the box as Javier Moraz and Jao Plata were in recovery. Nice ball wide to Zussi. Ramzusi, around Wager, Zusi crosses in, Biela couldn't control right in front of Atzanella that yeah, time. Yeah, as soon he saw Bob that, that, son. that he, he can't miss that chance, he can't, he just got jammed up, technically so gifted, Graham Zusi, in and out, gets the byline, kind of forced to pop it in quickly, but soon he saw it, just couldn't get his feet set, look how unmarked he is, inside the six yard box, it should be one nothing right now. Kamara with the step that time. Now Kamara. Interesting to see Kai Kamara switching out to this left-hand side, taking on Lavelle Palmer. Here's Saad getting back to the left foot. Hesitation. Saad, he's shot. Deflected uh, wide by Antonella. Very good touch by Jeff Antonella. This ball cut back, has eyes for the far post side net. Watch how quickly Jeff Antonella recovers. Good positioning, that ball goes back across, he gets down very, very quick. Cat-like reflexes, just gets fingertips with the left to push it outside the left post. Tonight for Sporting Kansas City, Graham Zussi will take it far side. Zussi in through the six, headed back across and saved off the line by Plata. It was bound for the side of the net that time. And Zhao Plata protecting the far post, kept it nil-nil. Free kick RSL straight away. Call it 30 yards out. Morales to take it. Hobby in. Back post, Nielsen lost it. Header goal! Finley in the back of the net! one nothing in the 56th minute! And oh, Jimmy Nelson, Nielsen, I should say, would love to have that one back. A terrible decision by the Kansas City keeper. Well, you're never going to see this again. You're never going to see Jimmy Nielsen make this kind of mistake. He just overran at fingertips and 
Real Salt Lake able to capitalize. Keeper comes off his line, slight touch, and Finley able just to push himself away from Sesanovic. Have the presence of mind to recognize where he was on the field. Gets that snap header up and over. Absolutely nothing Sporting Kansas City can do, and that is a mistake that you will not see Jimmy Nielsen make again. Ready to make their first subway sub tonight down below, and it will be the man we talked about. That man, Gomez Garcia. Remember, Winger's sitting on the yellow. He's going to get a second. And he's all out of all the out of all the calls to make. Wow. They're short-handed now. Wingard's done. Two yellows equal that red, and RSL's going to play a man down here. Well, that's the final 25 minutes and change. That's going to change the uh, substitution pattern for Real Salt Lake. Momis Garcia is going to take a seat. Abdullah Mansali is going to have to come in now. Great coach Jason Christ is going to have to take someone out alongside Chris Winger. Remember, Winger went the book for that challenge, the hard challenge on Kai Kamara. Uh, okay, I can see why. I can see why. I can see. Watch the left hand. Slight little grab. That's what gets him. RSL man down in front. Still loose in the box. Kamara turns. Antonella loose in front. Being knocked around and a goal. It's a goal! Kansas City's level the match in the 67th minute. Saad on a ball that couldn't be cleared by Real Salt Lake has leveled it at one. Well, Real Salt Lake couldn't get the substitution on to bring Kenny or Abdullah Mansali in. It's going to be Zhao Plata coming off, Abdullah Mansali coming in. But soon he saw it benefiting from the pinball reaction inside the six. Just watch the six yard box. That's all you have to do. Watch how many blue shirts are in on Jeff Antonella. Shouts for the handball. Ball skips through. One, two, clearance three, and then Sunni Saad. Great skill check right there from Sunni Saad. Watch the number 22 as he turns, adjusts his body in the air. A little side volley. Well taken goal from Sunni Saad. Levels, 68th minute. Just seconds, seconds after Chris Winger took his second yellow. And credit Claudio Vieira that time. Well, right now it's about good immediate pressure. At least one player from Real Salt Lake on the ball. Got to contest some type of service. Sonobic into the box. Then Sally getting caught up there with Opara. Bell Albert right at Antonella. Big save. Opara put it on a tee that time for Bell Albert. And he couldn't get it past the keeper. All-star this year for Sporting Kansas City. These two teams, both selections for anybody in Major League Soccer, three apiece. Unfortunately for RSL, their three All-Stars are on national team duty. Here's Garcia. Olmes Garcia. Left-footed drive. Oh, what a big save by Jimmy Nielsen. Well, there's that good look for Real Salt Lake. Olmes Garcia. He catches Aurelian Collin diving in. Creates the time, creates the space from that angle. RSL pointing at everybody, not marking anybody right now. Zussi in. Loose in front and a goal. Kansas City has scored! And it's Ico Parra in the dying seconds of the match. It's 2-1 Sporting Kansas City. For a game like this. And that's that. Forrester blows his whistle. And the 11 match unbeaten streak comes to an end. In far more than 90 minutes of soccer here tonight at Rio Tinto Stadium, Sporting Kansas City comes on the road.